Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. So as requested, um, I took a poll on my YouTube channel and a lot of you uh, voted that I do more Dollar Tree hauls. So here I am doing more Dollar Tree hauls. I will of course include some other videos and I will, of course will continue to do vlogs and um, Dollar Tree organization which we're actually going to do right after this video. So don't you worry, we're going to try to keep as consistent as possible with the stuff that we're already uploading. So this is going to be a pretty big haul, so I'm just going to go ahead and get started. I hope you're all doing well, um, but without further ado, I'm going to get right into the video because this is a long one and it's a lot of stuff. It's kind of a little bit of everything. I was initially going to separate it, but you know what, I don't know. Um, when I'm gonna be able to get on here and film some more for you guys. Sorry if the light goes in and out. It's like sunny and gloomy at the same time, so I apologize for that. But let's go ahead and dive in, shall we? These are some of the signs that I was able to get my hands on, you guys. I never am able to get my hands on um, these Easter signs. Like, ever have I ever been able to get my hands on them. So I was super thrilled that I got my hands on them this time. So these are some of the ones that I got. So I got the bunnies with the little cute tails. How adorable. I think I'm going to put this on Leilani's door. Um, I have these command hooks that I got in my recent Dollar Tree haul, which in case you missed, I will include a card up above so you can check out some more Dollar Tree hauls. But I found the command hook, so I'm just going to use this little command hook to hang this little sign on her door. I just think it would be so cute for Easter. So I picked that up. I also found this sign that says, We Believe in the Easter Bunny. I think this would be super adorable on like a coffee bar or something along those lines. <laughs> really anywhere. I'll probably end up hanging this one on my pantry door. I just think it would look super cute on there. So that is the plan. Every time I film videos, that person um, clicks their car alarm. I think it's the funniest thing. I got some magnetic pocket things. This is in the teacher section. Um, you guys want me to do some kid room organization or toy organization, so I'm planning to do that, you guys. So um, I'm getting some stuff here and there to make that video for you guys. Leilani's room is pretty organized, surprisingly. I'm really, really proud of it. Um, but her toys, uh, her arts and crafts could use a little bit more organization. So that's my plan with these. And I'll show you, I'll actually take one out so you can kind of see what they look like. I feel like I'm so dark. It's pretty basic. It's just like a pink pocket. It's got um, Velcro. But the this front part right here is clear. I mean, you could put all sorts of things. I'm thinking about putting maybe her paints in here. Um, stuff like that. But of course... Make sure you're subscribed. I will be sharing that on my channel. So don't you miss that subscribe button and the little notification bell so you're notified as to when I'm posting the videos on the kid room organization. After this video, we are going to be organizing the pet section in my house. It is madness in there. It is so, so disorganized. I'm actually pretty embarrassed to show you guys, but... It, would, it will be a fun project to work on with you guys together. Of course, using stuff from Dollar Tree. That's definitely something that I'm striving for on my channel this year. So we are going to be putting this little decal wall sticker, but we're not going to put it on a wall. It's actually, it's a really interesting cabinet. I'll have to show you guys. Um, it's kind of a lower cabinet. It's like perfect for pet stuff. Um, but it, this says, your paw print is in my heart. And I thought that would be so cute to put, like, when you open the door for it to have this on the actual door. I just think that would be so cute and it would add, like, a little touch. So I'm so excited to get organizing today. I also got some of these baby wipes for to have in my car. 
um, just for like if she makes a mess or she gets her hands dirty, she's eating candy or something, or she needs to wipe down her hands. That's why I picked these up. And these are the Sesame Street Hushables Sensitive Baby Wipes. And it says cushiony thick and you get 72 wipes in each pack. Um, I don't think I've ever seen this particular kind at the Dollar Tree, so I figured I'd give them a shot. I mean, it's mainly to wipe her little hands and, you know, stuff like that. A little mess that she may make while we are on a car ride. So sorry if this light is terrible, you guys. I'll try to move you guys this way. I just feel like it's so dark. Okay, back to the dog organization so I got some of these little canisters Dollar Tree has always had these like forever now they have little paw prints and little bones they also have them in red so if you prefer the color red they also have that color but I just got two in the black um, and I'm going to be putting some of the treats in here. I'll definitely show you guys. We're going to clean it together. We're going to organize it together. It's going to be a super fun project. So I'm so excited to, you know, get this going because I've been wanting to organize this space for a while. But I obviously want to show you guys. I wanted to be part of the Dollar Tree organization series that we have going on on my channel. My latte is... It's, uh, the ice is melting because I've been talking too long. I got some of these gravy train treats beef flavor sticks um, to put in one of those little jars. And they also have some more treats downstairs that I'll just use to fill the other one. I got Charlie some little balls. He loves to play with these little balls. He loves for us to throw them and he can go and catch them. He's into that. And I also found this really cool leash. Um, I thought it'd be nice to have for when we take him out to the park or, you know, when we take him out to PetSmart, Petco, stuff like that. So got a little leash. They have some cute things in the pet section at the Dollar Tree, you guys. I kind of wanted to do like a pet... Dollar Tree favorites, but is that too much for you guys? I don't know. Um, I also found this really cool, kind of random, um, but it's not in any particular order just because I need to get this video out. It says, take coffee with you, and it's a coffee notes shaped notepad. Isn't this so darling? I just had to have it. I love coffee. Um, I've been so good, you guys. I know... I mentioned in my previous video that I'm trying to save money to do some home renovations. I have not been to Starbucks in the whole year of 2019. Yes, please, a round of applause. Like, I'm so proud of myself. Um, I replaced it with McDonald's. Um, I don't always get a coffee at McDonald's. Today was just kind of like, I need to pick me up because I have so much work to do. But um, I don't buy coffee. I have replaced my Starbucks with the sweet iced tea from McDonald's. It's going to save me so much money. I'm thinking it's going to save me like $3,000 a year, which I'm going to be able to put towards my home renovations. And the, also the other thing that I'm eliminating is eating out. Um, because we can spend so much money eating out at the restaurants um, and stuff. So I've been cooking more, which is shocking. And I've actually been enjoying it because my kitchen is clean. So we're going to be saving a huge chunk of money there. The Dollar Tree hauls are going to stay just because that is my, that's what my channel's about. Um, but I am eliminating the Starbucks and the eating out because that's just something that I can totally totally control. Hopefully I don't miss any of the stuff I'm trying to show you as quickly as I can. I got these Sesame Street Hushables hand and face wipes. I wanted to carry these in my car. Just I like to be prepared as you all probably can tell I'm like super like overly prepared just because I've been in situations where I need a wipe or something along those lines and I don't like that feeling so I just overly prepare and my car is fully fully stocked 
with things like this. So I wanted to put this in my car. I have a whole organization system on there. So that's why I got those. I also got some more things for the dogs. They have these awesome little doggy waste bags. So I got some more of those. These are the Greenbrier Kennel Club doggy waste waste bags and you get 50 pieces which is a significant amount for a buck um, and then I also like these little bones where you put the actual little waste bag that comes with 40 pieces and I think I have um, different colored ones now so I got blue black and I think I might have a black one downstairs already but I like to be prepared I got some removable labels. This is gonna be for the doggy organization. Um, I just thought the blue and the gray would go pretty well together. Got some uh, Sesame Street band-aids for Leilani. I don't know about your kids, but she just likes to open them and stick them everywhere even though she doesn't have like a cut or anything like that. Got some thinning shears for Charlie. I also got some cotton swabs. These are the the ones that come with 250 and they're paper sticks. You can use these for all sorts of things and I always purchase these at the Dollar Tree because they're cheap. You guys, they have new bins at the Dollar Tree, but you're going to have to go like today or if not you should have been there yesterday because I tried to go back today and they don't have any more and I'm regretting not picking up some more of these beautiful gray ones. Um, I just wish Dollar Tree would bring out neutral colored ones like white in like a braided basket like this. Um, I wish they would bring out gray and have it stay instead of those like ugly colors like bright red br bright blue bright green like I wish they would kind of you know do e even clear or gray black anyway I got my hands on some gray bins <laughs> that's all I'm gonna say so these are so adorable you guys these are like little baskets they're so darling. I'm so thrilled. I love bins and baskets. This one is super awesome. I have a whole system planned out for my dogs. Um, I'm trying to buy Charlie some like shirts and stuff just because he sheds so much. You guys, if you have any recommendations, suggestions on like dogs not shedding so much because Charlie is like a whole... A whole nother kind of animal <laughs> because he shed so much but I love him and he's worth it but we're gonna probably buy him some more sweaters and shirts and stuff like that so he can stop shedding so much or at least so I can control some of it that's why I got these um, and maybe one for leashes and they're pretty spacious bins um, I've heard these are really good for in the freezer as well so I mean you thought possibilities are endless with baskets and bins but yeah I kind of regret not picking up some more but we're just gonna have to work with it these are the other bins that they have and I also got some gray bins for the doggies I got four of the gray bins and I got one of the pink bins for Leilani I think this will be good to store some of her puzzles um, or like markers crayons anything really they're by the brand Bella storage solution and they have a really nice like closure to them and they're kind of like a higher than like a shoe box I don't know they're really nice so I got one in pink because that's the only one they had and then I got four of the gray for the doggies and I'm gonna put those like labels right here you guys are gonna be part of the process don't you guys worry we're gonna be organizing our refrigerator as well you guys, these are one of my favorite organization bins from the Dollar Tree. I'm saying it here just in case I forget to mention it in like a favorites video. These are called fridge storage bin and you can pull them out. They have these like little pull out things. These are amazing. You can use these everywhere. I've used these in my pantry, I've used them in my refrigerator, I've even used these to organize Leilani's paints. Um, they're 
so amazing. You can use these to organize foundations because they're just like a little bit higher than the typical storage bin. You can use these to organize your moisturizers, your face moisturizers. They are amazing. They are so multifunctional, universal, and I just love them. So I got the ones that they had left. So they got they had three left. It's really hard to co come by these. I have a hard time finding them. So when I find them, I pick them all up typically because I love them so much. You can use these for so many things. And I love the height of it. These are perfect to organize yogurts, um, cheeses, like a string cheese. Um, I use these to organize some of my oatmeal packets. I mean, these, I just love these bins so much. I really do. These are one of my favorite bins that Dollar Tree offers. These are amazing. Okay, the next uh, are these two little, like, they look like wired little basket. These aren't the most durable baskets, but I think they're cute to corral toys, like balls for the doggies. So that's why I got those, just for, like, the bigger items, the toys. Maybe I'll use these in my closet because I have gray hangers that are this color. So maybe I'll even use these in my closet and I'll show you guys how I end up organizing that. That's a whole nother animal though because I've been trying to organize my closet for weeks. <laughs> and it's insane. But I am I am fully aware that I have gained weight. And I think one of the things that was holding me back from cleaning my closet was realizing how much weight I've gained um, because my belts no longer fit me so I've had to get rid of every single belt that I owned and I owned a lot of belts but I wasn't using them because they don't fit me but I love them um, they I had some really nice ones but anyway that's a whole another story and I've let go of a lot of those things because you know, they don't fit me. What's the point of keeping stuff that doesn't fit you? But maybe I'll use these for like socks. Um, you can put your socks in here if you roll them up like I do. Um, what else? Like scarves, hats. I think people can even store like shoes. Like if you have sandals. Yes, this would be cute for sandals and stuff. All right, moving right along. I didn't realize how much stuff I had, you guys. I'm so sorry. I've I've just been kind of slacking on the haul videos, and I'm sorry. I found this adorable little donut notebook, and I had to have it. You guys know I love donuts and, you know, cute themed items. These are great for my bags. They just, I love to look at cute stuff. And then this is the other one I found. Leave a little sparkle wherever you go. How appropriate for the YouTube channel, right? So cute. I got some permanent markers because I always am needing these and I don't have any. So I got some permanent markers. I don't buy the name brand just because that's a better deal. You guys, I found a bunch of cookbooks at the Dollar Tree. I was shook. I was so shocked. Um, this is baking mashup. I love baking. One of my favorite things to do in the kitchen is baking so I got this one I'm super excited about it they have some really nice pictures in here they're very cute you guys look at these oh my god yes please so I picked that up this is a um, dry erase board for Leilani I just feel like we're wasting so much paper so I just got her this so that she can draw on here she can start writing the alphabet um she's doing really good so i got her that so that she can you know start practicing here's another cookbook i found how to squeeze a lemon um this is so cute i really love the look of this but it gives you some really cool tips and stuff like really cool tips how to boil an egg perfectly every time where to, sto where to store butter in the fridge, planting butter, how to buy a chicken, put a lid on it, peel shrimp in a jiffy. There's so many tips and I need all the help I, I, I could get. <laughs> I'm sorry, I feel like I'm talking so fast. Oh God. 
let's go what else some more activity things for Leilani to do uh, color craze my first words they have these amazing books for kids you guys go to the Dollar Tree if you have kids if you have little ones believe me they have a lot of things for them to do so that they can stay occupied it's so that they you know will continue to learn and grow and develop amazing selection at the Dollar Tree okay more tags and stuff these are one of my favorite they're called white string tags by jot they have a little string I use these in my laundry room. I'll link a card up above so you can check it out. Um, I did a whole laundry room organization video, so go check it out if you missed out on it. And then I also have these file folder labels, so to organize more stuff and label stuff and be organized. But right now, down here, it's not organized. I got some markers for Leilani's little whiteboard. You guys, these are sheet protectors. This is how I organize my stickers. These aren't the best sheet protectors. I am fully aware of that because I've purchased some from Staples and those are really nice, but they work for my sticker organization. Um, if you guys would be interested in seeing that, let me know in the comments. Give this video a thumbs up. Show your support somehow so that I know that's something you would want to see. Leave a comment. So look at these flowers, you guys. I love, I die for this light pink shade. They are beautiful. They're roses. These leaves look super realistic. A dollar, you guys. A dollar. These are amazing. So, um, I love flowers. I'll probably put them somewhere in this room. They're gorgeous. I got a little um, hair donut for Leilani's hair. I'm sure I can I'm sure I can get away with doing this right now. It's like a little tiny donut. Um, I'm pretty sure this will work for her hair. More signs for Easter. Oh my god, farmhouse Easter signs are amazing at the Dollar Tree. Happy Easter. Happy Easter. Welcome to our patch. I missed out on these, you guys. I don't know that they had this one last year. I, I saw a bunch of people grabbing this one. This little guy is too cute for words. He's got a burlap bow. His carrots that are dangling are adorable. That say Happy Easter. Come on, this is so precious. Um, I'm going to use these in my coffee bar. If you guys would like for me to do a another decorate with me, uh, my coffee bar using Dollar Tree items, give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment so that I know. All right. Puzzles. Leilani has like a thousand puzzles. She got this one this time. Peppa Pig. She's really good at it, by the way, you guys. She really is. I got this. The greatest gift is family. This kind of had a farmhouse vibes to me, so I thought it was cute, and I picked it up. Only a buck, you guys. Only a dollar. We needed some zipper seal storage bags. These are quart size. Originally, these come with 16. There were some right next to these that had less bags. Always keep an eye on which one has the most for your dollar. Another thing I found, this was kind of like not necessary, but I I can't when it's sparkly. It's like so beautiful to me. Um, these go on your luggage. We're going to go on a trip soon, so... You'll probably see this while I'm on the trip. I don't know, you guys, um, but this is cute, right? I can put this on my luggage um, so it doesn't get lost on backpacks and stuff. More puzzles that Leilani picked out. She wanted Minnie Mouse and she wanted Paw Patrol. Paw Patrol is, like, so famous. She knows all the characters. It's crazy. She, like, shocks me. And she knew my mom's name. I'm like, how do you know my mom's name? I got some little bracelets. I have a collection of these. These are Minnie Mouse ones. I got a pink and a white Minnie Mouse. She got another puzzle. Um, the Mickey characters. We've got Goofy, Donald Duck, Mickey Mouse. You guys, this adorable candle. Unicorn Magic. Sugared Marshmallow Scented Candle. And it smells wonderful. I'm going to put that in her room since her room is unicorn theme. I'm going to be giving a cookbook away in this video. So in the comments you guys are going to have to tell me what 
I don't know you guys I'm gonna think about it right now but this is the chef's collaborative cookbook I'm gonna be giving this away this at some point retailed $40 this is such a heavy book it is so heavy it is so big it's got amazing pictures on here and recipes um, and that's why I picked it up. I picked one up for you guys because I just think it's a beautiful cookbook. I picked one up for you and one for me to participate in the giveaway. Make sure you're subscribed, hit the thumbs up button, leave a comment down below. I need you to put like where you're from, like what state you're from, what city, and then maybe like your email address. Um, yeah. So your email address, what state you're from, city if you'd like, and um, yeah, we're, we're going to go from there. You can always put more information, whatever you want, down below. You obviously want to be subscribed to the channel because this is for somebody that's deserving and supportive of my channel. So yeah, this is an amazing little... It's so heavy. I'm still so shocked I found this for a dollar. Okay, it retails for $40, which is insane. I also found this cookbook, Fresh Food Nation, Simple Seasonal Recipes from America's Farmers. And I just love these pictures, you guys. Love them. They're so pretty. Roasted Green Chile Cheeseburgers. Yes, please. I'm telling you guys, this is a ginormous haul. <laughs> My crock pot is a lifesaver. I have some really easy crock pot recipes for full-time people that have to go to work and stuff and don't have all day to be cooking up a, a meal. Um, if you'd like to see some of my favorite crock pot meals, let me know. I needed some more butterflies. I kind of have a bunch of butterflies around my door and I'm kind of missing some so I picked up some more rose gold butterflies. Look at this notebook you guys. Life is better with sprinkles. Isn't that the truth? Life is better with sprinkles and donuts and cutesy cute stuff. I just love this notebook, it's so adorable. Paper towels, we're just running really low on paper towels. Okay, what else did I get? Oh, you guys, I got these adorable candles for the bathrooms. Um, oh, they smell so good. I can't believe you get this at the Dollar Tree. I got coconut lime, I got indigo reef, and I got uh, pineapple punch. They smell wonderful. Great job Dollar Tree. The packaging is stellar on point. I haven't been to Bath and Body Works because um, if I do I spend more money than if I were to go to the Dollar Tree so in my mind you know I'm saving money because if I go to the if I go to Bath and Body Works the candle is not gonna be a dollar. It's just not. Okay. Something I'm also really excited about. Oh my god. Tell me this does not scream sparkle on forever room vibes. Yes, please. This is something, a piece of room decoration that I would put out for if I had a home collection. <laughs> it's so ridiculous sometimes. Okay, but yeah, I just thought it would go really well in this room. I picked up four of these. Aren't these beautiful? That's it. I hope you enjoyed this crazy Dollar Tree haul. I know it was a lot of stuff and I know that I probably am t I was talking so fast. Thank you for watching. Thank you for your support. I appreciate each and every one of you very much. Um, I'm blessed because of you. I am blessed because you watch me, because you support me. If you'd like to enter in the giveaway, leave a comment down below. Just make sure you include an email address. That way I'm able to reach you. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, hit the subscribe button, hit the notification bell. Also go show your support on my Instagram, at sparkleonforever. It really helps me out a lot. Share this video if you think somebody would enjoy this as much as you did. And I will see you guys in the organization video that we're gonna be doing together cleaning out more stuff, organizing, and um, I'm so excited. So I'll see you guys there. Bye.